Hi everyone, I'm Bram. You might know me as Bram's Designs on a few platforms or as Bramble's Crossing on a few more, uh, or I might be a brand new voice to you. Uh, whatever the case, welcome, I'm really glad you're here. So today I'm gonna walk you through one of my newest tutorials, which is all about how to make your own cutie little things uh, like this, for example. Uh, one of the reasons I decided to make this a guide instead of 160 design codes, there's 16 colors and 10 different pixel patterns I have, uh, is first because Nintendo currently has limited each online profile to only being able to post 130 designs, and if you delete ones to post more, then the old codes no longer work, which is a bummer. So feel free to at Nintendo and ask them to increase or remove the limit altogether for us so we can post more designs and share more work. The second reason uh, is that way, this way, you can customize your bangs to add whatever eyebrows, freckles, moles, scars, whatever you uh, want to use to customize your character to make them exactly how you would like to. Okay, so with all of that out of the way, let's go ahead and get started. So first thing you wanna do is open up your custom design app, and we're gonna start with a blank, plain custom design. So open up any of your slots and we're going to use the fill all tool. So press X, go down to fill all and we want to fill it in with transparent. So you can also change your preview so that you can see it on the little face, um, which might be really helpful to you, especially as you're adding things to make sure they're in the right place. I'm going to keep it here so you can see how the design progresses. So now that we have our empty design, we need to choose a pixel pattern. Um, so I have 10 different patterns of bangs that I've made so far. Um, you're welcome to choose any of them. I'm going to walk you through the wavy bangs today. All right, each of my pixel designs uses four colors, a main color, a highlight color, a shadow, and a core shadow. So this medium gray, light gray for your highlight, dark gray, and black for your core shadow. This is just to help us see which pixels are which more easily. Uh, and then we'll actually adjust it to the correct color later. So now you're going to take whatever pixel pattern you've chosen and you're gonna copy it step by step. So I'm gonna stop talking for a minute and I'm going to copy the one uh, called Wavy. Okay, so once you have all the pixels copied over, you are now going to change the colors. So we need to choose the correct hair color to match our character. So my character has the light blue hair color, so I'm gonna be using that guide today. All right, so a quick reminder, the darkest color is called core shadow, shadow, main, and highlight. So let's start with the main color. So according to my guide, the light blue hair color has a main color of Q58. So I'm gonna sing the ABCs. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q. All right, so here's color Q. And then we need vividness five. So that's one, two, three, four, five. And then brightness is eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there is our main hair color. Next, let's do the highlight. So it's going to be Q. So remember Q was here. And then four, one, two, three, four. And then a brightness of nine, which is right here. Our first shadow is Q, six, seven. So again, Q is here, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then seven, which is here. And then our core shadow, those darkest bits is Q, five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, and 
26. So now it's starting to look a lot more like bangs that actually match our character. So once you have all the colors adjusted, uh, you can go ahead and hit done and let's check them out and make sure they match. All right, so you're going to press A to wear them as face paint. And we should have cute little bangs that match our character. So now you can go through and add uh, whatever eyebrows or freckles. So let's go ahead and do some of that just so I can show you guys. So anything above this middle line right here, anything above is on the forehead, anything below is on the cheeks. So I'm gonna add some eyebrows for my character. So by pressing ZR, you can mirror and save yourself some time. So I'm going to add, these are the eyebrows that I usually use for my character. Just really simple. And then let's add some freckles and moles too. So I'm gonna turn off mirroring and we're gonna add just some random freckles. So remember anything below is on the cheek, anything above is on the uh, forehead. All right, some really simple eyebrows, there we go. So just to make sure it updates, we're gonna wear it again. And now we have eyebrows, bangs, and freckles. So there you go, that's the whole thing. Hopefully it's pretty easy to see and understand. Um, if you have any trouble, feel free to reach out or ask in the comments. Um, I'm on Twitter or Instagram. You can DM, uh, DM me on either of those. Um, good luck, send me all the pictures of your cute reps with their brand new bangs. I would love to see them. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye everybody.